Hey everybody, welcome back to the Binding Wise of Repentance. We have a minus one streak. Hey, I fat fingered uh, the, what's his name, the Fool card, so. Couldn't do the uh, Beast Path, so. We decided to torture ourselves and try and beat Delirium, and we lost. We took Delirium to about 1 16th of their HP and died. So now I'm going to play as Azazel again. We're going to do the exact same thing again, because I feel bad for Azazel. I nearly deleted the last video, I'm not going to lie. And the way this one is starting, maybe this is going to be another kind of deletion. But I was like, you know what? No. Let's show off my stupidity. And by stupidity, really, it was just a bad finger. But it, it hurt. It was painful. It tilted me out of all existence. Especially since, like, it's pretty hot right now. So, I'm already pretty hot under the collar. Anyway. Poke go or whatever this item's called, Pokeball. I missed. You throw it at an enemy and I think you pick them up as a charm variant. It's not really good as an item. But it's all we have. Uh, I've actually got enough money to buy an item in the first floor shop, which is really interesting. And I'm gonna take one. I'll take 4.5 volt. I quite like the item. Not the active item I want to combine with it, but, you know, we're at early doors. I will be going on to the alt path again. Don't you worry. You're mine. I missed. <laughs> it's really weird because a lot of items like this you sort of hold on to above your head and then you throw it. This one, like, as soon as you push the space bar, it just starts going. By the way, you can't capture bosses, funnily enough. Alright, we'll just kill you with three, so... I'll even take the hit. Just go to the next floor. Wow, a lot of money for the first floor. Like, that was like 20-something coins I think we got. Insane. Anyway, item room. Not good enough. I'm gonna re-roll. No. I do need bombs, but no. I, I want better. I can't help myself. <laughs> I've made a uh, second one of these. Okay, we need a perthrow card now. You're running into a little bit of, like, residual tilt from the last run. It's still in your veins. Like, we need to just, like, purge that stuff out of there. Oh my god, I did not expect you to come to the void. Played the room, we have a key. I could go into the shop. I do have no money, so... Maybe not my best idea. Uh, by the way, I'm probably going to try and double up the Go thing again. Why? Because if I get one penny, it'll be one penny more than the item's worth. I I'm gonna die on this run. Not even from like challenge, just from pure unadulterated skill. Uh, right, boss fight. That's just a guy I don't like as well, so that's terrific. Really need to deal with these yellow flies. There we go. Right, I could duplicate my boss item. Probably not going to be worth it. Okay. How about I get close to you and I just brimstone you down? There you go. It's more HP. We'll take the devil deal. We'll steal it. We'll steal it. We'll leave. It's not a very good devil deal, actually. Uh, there's nothing more I can do here, so let's just leave. I'm only willing to do that, by the way, on the devil deal, just because, as I said, it had no value to me. I was either going to leave or get them for free. I, I would say both these items are in the bottom 50 percentile. Cool your roll a little bit. You have two red hearts. 
we're on the mirror, mirror floor, so we have to do that. This room is pretty busy, if you had to open. Right, first I'll kill the guys that chase me down. That seems pretty smart. Then we'll kill this son of a gun. And then this son of a gun. And we're good. Just let them end their rotation. Go get an item. Turdy touch on mystery item. Not good again. Not gonna lie. All I need to do now is find a synergy that makes me vulnerable and I can just run into enemies. It's a big ass to, you know, get a synergy that means you just can't take any hits. Please? Oh my god. Oh well, we, we lose an angel and then we'll deal chance for whatever. It was highly, highly unlikely. Uh, okay, that's an interesting shot. One more room, we get another charge. If it's the enemy, so I see you. That's kind of interesting. I didn't have Holy Manta then, it's the loss. I guess it's because I turned into the loss in the room that the fire was in. And I guess Holy Mantle hadn't been set because I hadn't entered the room. You know what? I need something to purge my system. We'll do baptism by fire. Uh, okay. What was the deal with this challenge? Yeah, oh yeah, you, you're, you're a flamethrower and you need to be efficient. I remember. Just tap shooting. You know what? If you're going to walk into the fire, I'm not going to say no. Right, let me peek the shot. What are we after on this run? We're after something that can do damage for us. Like Daddy Long Legs. Remember there's no item room as well, because it's a challenge. I hate you. I've also already burnt through quite a lot of my ammo, which is a little bit worrying. Uh, yeah, I think this is as good as I can do right now. I hate that they block the fire. They are scumbags. Pure and simple scumbags. Okay, this is going to be an alternate damage source, so I can't really complain. I might complain, but I shouldn't. Okay, I ran out of ammo, so I turn my HP into ammo. Kill him. Get an orbital. Right, I can now use the orbital for damage. All I need now is... What's his name? Nord Leaf. I can't believe how close I was to doing this challenge. And I've just like thrown it all away. I think in general I should still try to try to use the power of fire. Ooh, would I re-roll this one? Yeah. I think I will re-roll this one if it gives me the option. No. So this is pedestals, which doesn't really matter. Health up is huge. I need a bomb for that. Just fire through and hope for the best. Let me see what's in the item room. Coupon and gold membership. Both interest me. Uh, I've lost my devil deal, but I'm not too sad about that. I kind of wanted the angel deal anyway. I mean, I'm not going to get the angel deal immediately, so it's still pretty bad, but... I'm not holding my hopes out on that. What I am kind of holding my hopes out on is that... I don't know, the four thing re rolls into something good. Because I'm not going to get enough money on the shop. So I guess it's going to be to decide whether or not the boss item is good enough or not. You know what, I'll take the hit to guarantee that. My ammo's actually pretty nice right now. 
I also think HP is fine, because I can convert it. I think I'm just going to leave. I ignore the dice room. Remember, I can't get away to protect my red hearts because I'm Bethany. Okay, that was quite expensive in terms of ammo. Well, he did mean I didn't get hit, so we'll take that. You're still alive, really? I'm using a lot of the old HP here. Uh, we'll play this safe and do this. Again, if I can protect my eternal heart, that'd be pretty big. Nice room. Very nice room. Chariot is pretty big as well because I have an orbital. It's not worth using for that. I still don't have enough money to go to the shop, so I'm considering just leaving. Because I could protect my internal heart. That seems very smart. I panicked. Pure and simple, that was panic. I also can't use the battery charge. It's pretty funny. Okay, Devil Deal. We're just going to turn it down. I want Angel Deals, not Devil Deals. Although I have a Strength card. Yeah. Bleh. I'm happy with what I have. Okay. Good HP now. So I'm not just going to spontaneously drop dead on the room. This is pretty bad use of ammo. Gold bombs is massive. I actually could do the floor now without using the fire. Hmm. This is a bit of a dangerous room to do that, so I think I'll kill these guys with my fire. Come on. Good boy. Again, I'll just like... I'll play it by ear, I suppose. Like, I had full ammo then, so... I was like, you know what, let's just melt them. Might as well try and find secret rooms as well. But we were given a great gift on this deck. Okay, you have enough ammo to melt them. Nearly stuck one in there. We weren't efficient, but it doesn't really matter. What am I going to use this strength card on? I don't know, actually. Ooh, I've done something a bit stupid. <laughs> I kind of trapped myself in the room with a bomb. Let's blow up mushrooms. Why are we blowing up mushrooms? Could be magic mushroom. I know the health up pill is. I don't know what bad trip is. Do I really want to take mystery pills now though? Because health up is literally the only one that's good for me. So I think I just leave it. Okay, that wasn't worth I'm just going to call it here. It was a bad play. <sighs> so is this, you know. Thank you. Bomb that. This isn't the secret room. That's not a secret room. This is the shop, though. Oh, I would buy broken modem if I could. And I might be able to. Just have to make some more money. Come from nowhere. Statue. Yeah. Okay, that helps again. It's a defensive item for me. I've done something really stupid here. Yeah. And it's going to get me hit again. Lead with fire. That's broken modem helping me. Right, checking for secret room. Checking for secret room. We've been asking for blind card for a long time. I, I, I can't get in there. 
I'm trying to think of what synergy would I want. Blank card strength doesn't quite cut it. Although, oh no, I can't swap, can I? I have to swap with Guppy's Paw. I also don't have flight, and I don't think I'm going to get a way to gain flight. If I strengthen Guppy's Paw, do I get to not lose the 1 HP? I don't remember how that works. Let me use a good bomb. Oh my god, modem. <laughs> Scared me. Uh, no bomb. Unlucky. Unlucky again. Right, that should be full ammo for the next floor. That's pretty good. The screw is kind of irrelevant now that I think about it. We take this. This is the safer play. And I do not want to anger the statue. I think this is fine. I was trying to think of a way of, like, you know. Because I get an eternal heart on every floor, so I could gain loads of HP, but then I can't gain ammo anymore. This is another defensive tool. I just want to try this, because I can't get blank cards, so if I queue for strength. Like up his paw. Do I lose the HP? Yeah, I do. Okay. It's honestly fine. I'm willing to accept that for the test. So you can't steal a guppy paw charge. By the way, the bone heart is huge. It's easy to protect. Than my normal heart. Also, that floor where we basically, you know, didn't use ammo is pretty big for us. Come on. It basically allowed me to accumulate some bombs as well. I have nine bombs now. It, it's all beautiful. Okay, I got a little bit screwed by a broken modem then. Just gonna throw that out there. I have 14 spirit hearts. I'll do it. Joker. Tower. We're going to Joker immediately. And that's not what I wanted. Wanted the Angel deal again. For sure. How have you got so much HP? my friends. Right, it's not health up pills, so we don't care. There aren't useful pills. It, like, Lemon Party would be fine. As a pill. Great fight. Tinted Rock, that's pretty nice. And really, I don't need to use that much. Oh, it's Small Rock. It's kind of annoying, because I you know, can't use my tears, but... Okay, again. Mystery pill, mystery pill. I wish you could remember what the health up pill looked like. Okay, that's pretty good. I will use a bomb hit key. And I think I saved my other bombs. Ooh, you nearly got hit then, you fool. You know what? This spear might actually be the carry for the run. If I can gain enough HP, it does so much damage that I'm feeling good about life again. Pin, you scumbag. If I can get the shield from an angel deal, that'd be pretty excellent. I can also put fires out with it, which is pretty nice. Uh, I'll buy ammo for three cents. Sure. Do, 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 do. I don't think I've ever had this much ammo before either. So looking good, honestly. 
Broken modem also slows enemies down for me just to poke them. I like the combat. Right, this is probably the most dangerous room. I accidentally converted another HP then, but I can live with it, because I'm going to try and melt this guy. Anyway. To protect my heart. Die, please. Okay, didn't cost me as much as you'd think. The third time I can go into the devil room, I say nay. Just move on. Gain another HP. Right now I'm just leaving Guppy's paw there just in case the worst happens, but I really shouldn't ever have it on my space bar. Full ammo. Nice. You're going to explode. You're just going to run at me so I don't need to fire. Uh, creep, if you wouldn't mind dissipating. Thank you. It's kind of annoying because the change of direction I'm looking in like, cost me... Oh no, it didn't actually expend anything. Never mind. I, you can just hear the, like, the little fire like, I go... Like a little roar. But it actually cost me no ammo to do that. Hmm. That was pretty dumb. Okay, actually kill him. There is a tinted rock in here. I don't want the tinted skull. I think. Yeah. Ooh. I will use ammo on this room. Oh my god, another tinted rock. <laughs> I hate these bonies, man. They suck. 23 spirit hearts. I have to protect the bone heart. Let me go out a different way. <laughs> Keep firing. Nice. That's huge. I will trade a bomb for potentially two spirit hearts. Mind. Could also have been zero, of course. Which it was. Not the health up hill. Well, I feel really, really strong. Really strong, really confident. Broken modem nearly screwed me. Right. Sneaky, sneaky. Uh, I'll spend a key for two keys in the chest, which has a bunch of money in. Did I go to my shop yet? No. Again, what are we looking for from the shop? Spirit hearts, maybe a bomb. I wouldn't mind a speed up as well, actually. I'm a little bit slow. Let's just fire through. Okay, this is not your best plan of action, I think. Again, I'm just trying to save some ammo with the spare. Pretty good going, though. Okay, we can't save any ammo with this guy, unfortunately. I have to blow you up with fire. Come on! The other fellas, though, I can just kill with the spare. Perfect. We even are going to get to go to our shop. That's pretty nice. Broken modem. Kind of messing me about a little bit here. Hmm. I think we just buy this and leave. Red candle is an interesting shout, though. Because that's now damage that... I don't have to worry about. Yeah, okay. I, I approve of this. Nearly not what I did then, but... Isaac. We could really just melt mom. So 
Why am I messing about? The whole point of saving ammo is to burn the hard fights like this. Great, great fight. I make boss rush. There's also a tinted rock over here, and I will bomb the tinted rock. We've honestly looked after ourselves early in the run. I've reversed the tilt so far. Now, I could lose this run and then go back into tilt, but... All I'm looking for now is health upgrades. Like, I'm not willing to mess about with you guys. You guys, I might mess about with. Okay, I shouldn't have messed about with you. It was my bad. I honestly thought that they couldn't walk through the sphere. But I guess they have a little bit more health than I thought. I thought I got a tinted drop as well when I left there, but nope. I really should be messing about with my health, as I said. Like, I'm, I'm not perfect yet. Uh, this was a bit of a dangerous room, so I use a lot of ammo for it. Just melting the, like, the reaction shots that these guys get makes it a lot easier. I'm also going to pick up this red heart now. If I can save, like, as I said, this 29 ammo for the Isaac fight, I can literally just use Flame Flower. This is another fight I'm just not messing about with. Just kill it. Uh, again, I want an angel deal, not a devil deal. So I'm going to say no and move on. Really, this was stupid. We should be one more HP up. I should also be looking for the, the secret room. Rather than just coasting it in. I did use an ammo then, but... There so goes the Eternal Heart again. I said it's so much harder to hold that Eternal Heart in the late game. Holy moly, we found the boss super early. Okay. You can kill a spider with your spear. Come on. Easy. Just, this is just free money right now. And by money, I mean ammo. I will pick up the red heart. It is a second secret room. Please be good. Well. Okay. Ooh. You know what? I don't feel as bad about losing that. Eternal heart now. That was a pretty nasty rotation. So we've got five underneath your bum. Remember, I still have this tower card. Stop using every single spirit heart. Okay, never mind. Use more spirit heart. Just win the fight, win the fight. Right, we could go fight Hush, but I'm deciding not to. One more floor. And what's going to do it for us is going to be the tower card. Which we should use in the second phase. Right? We want to get through the second phase as fast as possible. Now, you know what? Maybe we'll use it in the first phase. And then we'll just melt it with fire in the second phase. Okay, I've changed my mind about what I'm going to use to do this for. I will use a flame. I mean, 20 spirit hearts is still really good. I'm also now accumulating bombs, as I mentioned before. The Eternal Heart is also an extra hit. I'm not being efficient right now. I'm kind of just blowing my ro load right now, I'm not going to lie. I wouldn't mind killing you with my spear if I could. I could. Boss Trap Room is going to be a big no. This is going to be a big yes. Hmm. Definitely a loss there, but... I should honestly just use the spear. 
Well, there goes the eternal heart again. Famine, get out of there. <laughs> not lose the bone heart. The bone heart is more important than you think. I am losing a lot of blue hearts right now. I'm not going to be able to just machine gun him down as I was hoping for. That was pretty good. Yeah, yeah, I approve of that. You know what? Ammo? 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 Ammo. Yes, more ammo. I think I'm... I think I might be on the right path as well. Which is pretty good. Can you please come over here? You little cheeky winkies. Can I just do this with the spear? Yes. I I'll trade one hit now. Like, the eternal heart was irrelevant. It's gone anyway because I lost it before. Okay, more red hearts is more good. Okay, we have gone the wrong way, unfortunately. Pick up a half red heart and move on. You just need one of them. Boss up here. Ooh, dangerous room. I should just do this. As stupid as this looks, that's the correct play. I have enough hearts on the floor. Anyway, I'm nearly back to 20 ammo. Let's use a bomb here just to make this really clear. Can you please not do that? It's kind of clean. Okay. We are now going to use a drop fire. I lost the bone heart. It shouldn't matter, but it's a bit frustrating. Let me try and find a secret room. Sweet. Not sweet. Okay, sure. A secret hidden key. For health, Isaac fight. The tower. Tower has been bumped, remember. <laughs> if only I found blue candle. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, that's a hit. Alright, let's just start machine gunning down. Please don't use the Isaac. Right, second phase. I'm one HP. Just machine gun him down! What the fuck are you doing? Why are you messing about? Please, he's safe in the corner. Machine gun him down. Use everything you have. He's dead. Just take the challenge. Purgatory has appeared in the basement. Yeah, no kidding. Anyway. Kind of ironic. We'll call it there. It was effectively a two-run video. We beat the challenge baptism by fire and recovered from tilt. Thanks a lot for watching, ladies and gentlemen. See you next time. Goodbye.